How about Josh McDaniels, who knows what it's like to be the head coach there in Denver. Now he's back in the division once again with Vegas and Derek Carr and a team that did make the playoffs last season. Yeah, and it's similar to Minnesota, right, Chris? When you walk into the, ki the kitchen for the Las Vegas Raiders, you open the cabinets, you got spices there, but you're missing one key spice. Whenever I'm cooking my fried chicken, my go-to spice is garlic powder. If I don't have garlic powder, my fried chicken won't taste, it, it, it won't be at its best. And what the Raiders are missing right now, they're missing a wide receiver one. That's like their garlic powder. That's like my garlic powder. They got to go find a wide receiver one because they got a quarterback, they got a running back, they got a tight end. Offensive line, especially healthy, we know what that unit could do. But they don't have a wide receiver one. I love Hunter Winfro. Yes, I do, especially in the red zone. But he's not a wide receiver one. If they can go out, Josh McDaniels, that is, if they can go out and get one of these guys, ideally, Devontae Adams. I mean, if you can make that happen, wow, look out. But if you can't go get a guy like Devontae Adams, you got some other nice names on this list that would definitely improve their offense, would, that would, inde would indefinitely take their offense another step, especially within their division. So me personally, Mike Williams, Chris Godwin, Devontae Adams clearly would be tops on the list. But if you can't go get Devontae, what about a Mike Williams? And not to mention, if you get add Mike Williams to your offense, you're plucking him away from a divisional foe in the charges. Think about that, and you instantly get better, or you can add a guy like Chris Godwin. But that is the spice that is missing in their cabinets there for the Vegas Raiders. They don't have any garlic powder, or they don't have any wide receiver ones. They got to go get a wide receiver one. Is that why you sent that Cornish game hen back from room service at the Super Bowl a couple of years ago? It didn't have enough garlic on it? It didn't have enough garlic on it. You remember that, Chris. I was so disappointed. <laughs> And what I ordered. Got the Cornish game hen from, from room service at the hotel why, why in Atlanta. Why did I even do that? It didn't I, make any sense. I, I bet you'll never do it again. BMAC with us here right. on CBS Sports HQ looking to fix some offenses around the NFL. Uh, you can hear him on the All Things Covered podcast with Patrick Peterson. Latest episode, uh, really diving into Carson Wentz's future with the Colts, is there one? And maybe a possibility of an Aaron Luck return. Ah, excuse me, Andrew Luck return. Uh, that's on the very latest All Things Covered podcast. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis. No yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.